Hi, this is Ramu, Assistant Professor, Department of CSC, Institute of Aeronautical Engineering, Hyderabad. In last class, we have seen how to read the, sorry, how to create a files in Python. We have seen. In today's class, we are going to see how to access the data from the files, as well as how to append the data at the end of the file. We will see these two functionalities, as well as we will see some functions like tell and seek functions, the purpose of the tell and seek functions. Here, how to read your files? If you want to read the file from the file, you should open the file in the read mode. Please note this. And the function is available read f dot read means f is a file object. Read is a function by using read function, we are going to read the data entire in the form of string. The data is stored at the sum data variable. Please note this the data is in the string format. Right now, after that, you just use a print statement by using print the, the data, and after that, you just close the file. Let us see how to read the data from the input. For example, if you create a file, see, what you have seen should open a should create a file in the form of w mode for i in range of. 100 otherwise just use the n also right f dot write of string of i right n is a data n equal to int of input Right? If dot close. If you run this code, now the file is created. Now our task is to read the data from the file. Now data is available at the IRE.txt. Our task is to read. Right? If you want to read the file, if you want to read the file. If you want to read the file means I'm going to Come comment these two statements and the data is available. If you open your file in the read mode, read mode, and this statement is also not required for us, right? Simply data is equal to what is the function is available in the Python read, right? F dot read f dot read. print off data. If you run this code, then you will get the data. Why you data written like this? So it didn't give it any space, just it stores 0, 1, 2, 3, and it's clumsy. Right? If you want to use some extra space, for example, if you use a W mode, and if you run this code, then you'll get an error. It's not readable. Is it possible to perform both reading and writing operations at a time? Yes, it is possible. Already we have seen plus mode. Plus means it will perform both reading as well as a writing mode, right? So you just use a W plus. Then it is possible to perform both reading and writing operations. See, if you run this code, we didn't get anything. The reason is, what is the reason? For example, if you use a read plus mode, then see. The reason is your cursor is placing at the ending position. If you want to know that one, tell is a function. Tell. So tell is a function. It will return where is where is your cursor position. Where is your cursor position? So, if you want to know the cursor position, you just use here. No, I think we opened in the W mode, right? So data may be gone. Yes, yes, sorry. Data may be gone. Yes, 
Now, if you try to F tell, handwrite, 190, you are at the 190th position, 190th position, means the data is simple, it is very, very simple. So, if you open your file in a W mode or write mode, what happened? Your cursor is here. Right? After writing the 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 like this, so 99 last. Your cursor is here. After that, we are going to read tell. Tell means where is your position? 99 means, so simply it is a 2 bytes per data. That is why it took that much of memory. So, 190th position. 190th position. That is why it returns 190. And when it comes to F read means, from here, there is no file is there. There is no data is available. That is why it return empty. It's written empty. Is this clear? And if we want to read the data, then what should we do? Means you should place that the position of the cursor at the starting position. How it is possible? By using seek function. Seek is a function to set the cursor. Set the cursor. By using seek function, you are going to set the cursor. See, let us see how to place my position. Here, after this performance, I am just using f dot seek of 0. If you run this code, handwrite, you are at the which position? 0th position. Now, we will get the, all the data, get the entire data. Is this clear? This is the way we are going to read the data. Plus mode will help you to perform two operations, reading as well as writing. But if you observe this program, every time if you create a new file, I mean W plus mode or read plus mode, what happened? The data is overwriting. What have what we need to do if you want to add data at end of the file? If you want to add data at end of the file, end of the file. See, if you run this code, 10 means the 10 is data is there. Yes. 20. Data is there. Right? Is this clear? Every time the new data is created. But if you want to add data at the end of the file, end of the file, what should we do? What should we do? So even in earlier also, if you open in the read mode, what happened? It is going to clear the data up to that particular part. Means it is going to overwrite. Finally, it is going to overwrite. But if you want, if you want, create a new file, new file, then it is, it is, you should use a W plus mode. If you want to add a data, for the better understanding, I am going to use A plus mode, C. Already the data is up to 10 is there, right? If you run this code, I am going to apply 10, one more 10, then C. This is the previous data and this is the new data. It was, it, sorry, this is the new data which we added now. If you run this code next time, if you run this code the next time with the 20, then see. So, this data is earlier data. And we are going to append the data. Is this clear? By using A, append mode. Append mode will work you going to add the data at the end of the file. That is the difference between the W plus W mode and append mode. W mode, if you open your file in the W mode, cursor at the starting position. Starting position. If you open a file at the append mode, end of the file. End of the file. That is the only difference. And as well as, if file is exist, it overwrites. Here, the file is exist at place at the end of the, if the file is not exist, then it creates a new file. 
it creates a new file. So there is no loss here. Data loss is not possible in append mode. But when you open in a W mode, then the data is overwrites. The data will be lost. Is this clear? And as well as by using F tell and C. By using the two functions, you are going to place the cursor at the particular position where you want. Right? Is this clear? And my suggestion is try to do some project, one project, a small project. Just take our library management system. Right? The library management systems, every day we are going to take the books and as well as that uh, return the books, right? The same pattern. You just design a small system. That system, it contains a uh, data in each each entry. The entry should be entries. Each entry should be separated with the hash. If you want to add the hash, means the first one entry and second entry hash, third entry hash, fourth entry hash. Right? According to that, you just retrieve the particular data and ID. Right? So the starting with that roll number and the book name like that, you just create your own data set. Right? Try to apply the Python concepts as well as the files. Try to store the data into the files. Just simple project. It will understand where and how much knowledge you gain from the Python language when you apply the real time only. So don't, uh, what it is called, uh, just by watching videos, you didn't get anything. If you apply your knowledge into the particular application, then only you'll understand the things. As well as uh, almost 180, 200 problems are available in the build item. Try to solve all the problems. You'll get the more and more what is called knowledge, right? So if you apply your concepts into the some platforms, then only you'll get the knowledge. Otherwise, you didn't get anything. By only practice, in only help you to improve our coding knowledge and try to apply in the spores and various applications are available. I mean, online platforms are available, right? So everything is very, very help you, right? Thank you. Thank you very much. Like, share and subscribe. Hit the bell icon for more updates.